What is up, guys? Um, uh, so I came down with this suggestion to have a countdown of the top six campaign maps for Left 4 Dead 2. Um, to be noted that um, there will be spoilers ahead, so if you don't have any spoilers, please be please just don't watch the video. Um, and also, um, uh, some of the maps is already in game provided, uh, and some of them will be need to be downloaded from the workshop. Yeah. And the link will be in the description below, so feel free to download it and give your reviews on it. Um, so yeah, let's do the countdown and start for now. What I like, what I really like about this map is because of the game design, uh, of the, of the plane. I kind of like it. Uh, yeah, I kind of like it and the parachute part. And as you can see, I'm in the Great Wall. I also like how they design the Great Wall to make it a pretty big freaking maze. And also, it will give you some rage quit, like what I have been through. As you can see, I have a rage. <laughs> Alright, the reason why I choose Tanks Playground is because it has freaking big, it has freaking big buffy tanks attacking you. Yeah, so you have to try to survive. Um, I know you guys will be saying, oh, survive? Is this survival mode or campaign mode? But like, but because they have a rescue, yeah, they have a rescue, and I kind of like how they provide the weapons, like a big maze. Yeah, but sometimes if you get rage too, if you drop inside the water and you die, yeah, that's the reason why I choose tanks playground in my number fifth position. The reason why I choose Die Scraper as my number four position is because I just felt a sense of love to this to this map. I don't know why. Maybe because a spoiler at a at, 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 at a helipad, if you realize a glitch, um, if you stand there, there will be a wind that will blow you off, and it can quite be a rage if you are if you are a rage and you just fell down the building. It will be a huge, 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 huge rage. Or maybe it could be those scary parts, like now see the boomerang explode on me. Yeah, I literally got scared about that. But overall, this map really gives me like some, some, you know, kind of a sense of love to this map, something. The reason why I choose the parish is my number 3 position because it's really literally it, it's my first ever campaign that I ever tried to play in my Left 4 Dead 2 life. Um, it, it, yeah, I just like it because it, I don't know, because as you can see there will be a bridge which is the final level of the, of the game where rescue will come. Uh, I really like that because I don't know why, I just feel a sense of love to the to the to the yeah to the bridge because it's like just a chung like charge everything to the to the end uh. yeah so this is why I choose number the parish. Okay, the reason why I choose R T RMS Titanic X my number two position is because it 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 has a very great story story script script description script of the story 
it, it like from the bottom of the ship it brings you to this to the top of the ship it's like an adventure to escape the ship and at the end you escape the ship as a survive a bit of a like a few minutes of survival and then the rescue will come to you yeah and there's some mazes which which will give you some creeps and, and scary stuff yeah and overall it's, the game is really nice design and i really like this map a lot because me i watched titanic and i really like that movie a bit so <laughs> but the ending is a bit crappy because it's not really that much of an action but overall it's still fun yeah. so just watch it Titanic as my number two position. Reloading. Reloading. Get in. Get in the boat. Get in the boat. Oh. Boom. One looks. Oh, there's a boat. You can see it. You can see some orange stuff. I don't know what that is. The reason why I choose the passing as my number one position is because you have a very shocking. You'll be like you because you met the your your like your princesses like level day two survivors meet with level day one survivors. That really that really give me a like action type something. So I really like that school. And then and at the end you can see the build guy the guy in the green shirt. It's kind of shocking for level day because to see him die. Because at first I don't want him because I'm a friend of him and I'm and I'm quite a bit of sad when he died when I see him die. So that really give me a shocking and give me a liking to the passing. So yeah, that's the reason why I choose the passing because it has a lot of adventures and story into it. Alright guys, so that's the end of the video. I'm too excited to broadcast it to the top six campaign number one. Yeah, I'm excited to do that. And this all this is to my opinion. So if you guys have any disagree, I'm so sorry, that's my opinion. To note, okay, so there's spoilers, I'm sorry that I give you spoilers, but that's what I want, I need to do that. Right? And I hope you guys enjoy it, please click on, please click on the subscribe button for more other videos, the like button, the share button, everything. Share to your friends, subscribe to me, more, 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 share everything to me. And to make me a better YouTuber, I will make more, more of this kind of countdown and camping videos and gaming videos for you guys. So with that, I'll see you guys in the next video. See you guys.